welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Gloria in today's video I want to tell you five reasons you should stop buying affordable perfumes I like to buy affordable perfumes that smell expensive so if I tell you today I want to tell you five reasons you should stop buying affordable perfumes you should know that there is a reason behind it the number one reason is you are going to end up filling up your whole space with perfumes do you know why because you feel ah uh, how much does it cost twenty dollars it's not that expensive you buy one next time it's not that expensive you buy two before you know it you have gotten 10 15 perfumes within the space of two weeks and when you begin to calculate twenty dollars thirty dollars add everything together it amounts to what big money but if you're buying expensive perfume where you know that okay maybe one perfume is like two hundred dollars you think about it twice do i really need to buy this perfume do you think twice about it when you want to make that purchase you think twice about it but when you're buying affordable perfumes you don't think at all your thinking faculty flies out throughout the building you are not even thinking you see what i mean affordable perfume will put holes <laughs> in your pocket and the thing is with these affordable perfumes they find good perfumes even though they are affordable so because of that you're buying a lot so your whole house will be filled with perfumes especially if you do not have like a designated space in your space where you house your perfumes where you keep your perfumes you keep buying and buying and buying until you don't even have space to keep them anymore number two reason why you should stop buying affordable perfume you will struggle you will struggle to choose a perfume for yourself every single time so because you have gotten a lot of perfumes every time you're going out you are struggling with which perfume to wear you're always struggling you're always confused but if you have maybe one or two or three perfumes you know that this one is my everyday perfume this one is my date night perfume this one is my uh party perfume you already know but when you're going on a date you know that okay this is the perfume i'm wearing when i'm going out like i'm going to the office i'm running errands this is the perfume i'm wearing you already know if you have lots of perfume because they are affordable so you have a lot of perfume that makes you struggle every single time to pick out a perfume for yourself i know at first when i said stop buying affordable perfume you'd be like huh what is she saying i know the number three reason because you have a lot of perfumes but you'll be thinking it will take a lifetime to finish all the perfumes in my collection so because of that anytime you're going out you are over spraying like from your head to your toe that way you overwhelm yourself you overwhelm the people around you because you have so many perfumes so you're wearing wearing so that you don't have lots of perfume just sitting you want to use them you overuse them but if you're buying expensive perfume you will not have so much so before you buy you will think about it but when they are affordable you go all in you can even buy 10 at once sometimes if you end up not liking some of the perfumes you just buy them and keep them in your shelf after a while you declutter them so you see the number four reason why you should not buy affordable perfumes you will be addicted to buying perfumes <laughs> You will be addicted to buying perfumes because you are now a perfume collector, a fragrance collector. You will use all your money to buy perfumes. Now you will struggle to save because you are collecting perfumes. I saw a video on TikTok by Vivian. She also has a YouTube channel here on YouTube. And then she was talking about mastering the art of contentment if you decide to start collecting perfume you must have mastered the act of being contented with what you have as regards perfume i agree but the thing with being contented with perfume is hard it's difficult 
because they will always be they, they will always release new perfumes they will always release new flankers you will want to know what it smells like the thing is for the people who have not started collecting perfumes yet but they like the idea of collecting perfumes you better think about it twice because once you enter it is difficult for you to go out in deviant words once you enter this cult it's difficult for you to get out of it like you will find yourself using all your money even though you've not eaten you will prefer to use the money that you used to eat and buy perfumes that's how bad it is <laughs> to have savings now will not be difficult is that a good thing i don't think it's a good thing for me it's a little bit um fair because before i started actively collecting perfumes i sell perfumes okay so sometimes when i buy a perfume to review because perfumes i buy to sell are different from the ones i buy to review sometimes i end up not liking them so what i do is i keep them for sale so you know how it is with perfume sometimes you you don't like a particular perfume but other people will like it it's what it is nobody can change it the worst perfume you think you hate you will see someone else that loves that perfume it's what it is so for me it's a little bit easier okay when i put them aside i still see someone that like the perfume that wants to buy the perfume so because i already unboxed it i sell it at a discounted price so that is why it's a little bit um, um easy for me i sell perfumes before i started actively collecting perfumes and reviewing perfumes okay so if you're planning to start collecting perfume think about it twice think about it twice the lord is your strength the number five reason why you should stop buying affordable perfume you always want to smell good even when you're going to the restroom you spray perfume you're going downstairs to quickly pick up something you spray perfume you want to go out and eat you spray perfume like for everything you want to do you spray perfume that way it will not make it difficult for you to take perfume breaks which is actually necessary you need to take breaks on perfume every once in a while take perfume breaks do you see why i say you should stop buying affordable perfumes me i'm working on myself we are all in this boat together i'm already working on myself to slow down on jumping on every viral perfume i'm i'm talking to myself i'm being intentional about taking breaks and the thing is affordable perfumes now they are not even that affordable anymore affordable perfumes that used to sell for 7k 10k 12k 9k sometimes 5k 6k they are not affordable anymore right now perfumes are from at least reasonable perfume you will get 20k 18 25 35 50 50 70. so perfumes that used to be affordable they are not even affordable anymore because the dollar rate keeps going up so affordable perfumes are not affordable anymore so i'm speaking to myself to take it slow so that at the end of 2024 i will be able to say okay i have 10 perfumes and these perfumes i have are perfumes i love perfumes i like let me quickly say another one another reason you should stop buying affordable perfumes is you buy a bunch of affordable perfumes and you might end up not liking a lot of them you just have it for the sake of having you just want to have let your shelf be full and people will come and say oh my god you have a lot of perfume and then you're like oh yeah i'm the fraghead i think that's the word they use now that's the name they call perfume collectors now fraghead oh yeah yeah i'm a fraghead i love perfumes i'm a perfume collector guys that's all i have for you today in this video i hope you understand the point i'm trying to make in this video and i hope you gained one or two things till i see you in my next video don't forget to click the subscribe button if you have not subscribed yet i will see you in my next video remember to have a beautiful wonderful celebration